I guess in the simplest way of looking at the tax credit might be if you owned a business and you said to potential customers, come and spend a hundred dollars in my in my resort, spend spend twenty five bucks on food and twenty five bucks on liquor and spend fifty dollars in the in the gift shop and you know you give me proof that you spent that hundred bucks and we're gonna we're gonna give you back twenty five dollars. It's that twenty five dollars that I, that is available in most tax credit jurisdictions, including Ontario, Manitoba, Alberta, and British Columbia. That's the money that they're saying, no, we're not going to give you the $25 uh, rebate. We're going to uh, turn it into uh, one quarter of that. Well, I think what she's got wrong is that we are now uh, ha have lost uh, any ability to compete successfully with uh, Ontario, Manitoba, Alberta, or British Columbia. It's pretty much an, a complete about face from from their campaign promises. Um, you know, I, I I recognize that they have the right to do it. I, I do hope that they understand that a thousand jobs will leave this province uh, before the end of the year. It's like saying to half of the welders in Nova Scotia, never mind, we don't need you anymore. Uh, you don't have to go where you can find employment. Oh, gee, maybe that might be Alberta. The existence of the movie industry on the South Shore has been a big boom to the local businesses all the way from Hubbard's through Chester uh, into Gold River on into Mahone Bay, uh, Lunenburg, and all the way down to Liverpool. The finance department has never wanted to recognize the spin-off benefits. They've never wanted to recognize that, for instance, Haven uh, brought a lot of money into this community. Um, people renting houses, people selling us lumber, people selling us gas and food and, and location fees for uh, their property that we would be uh, shooting on. Uh, and that was millions of dollars in the case of Haven over its five-year run. Um, and of course, that, that that too will disappear along with uh, along with the jobs. What does concern me is that the finance department, in looking at this multicolored world, is actually just counting the yellow beans. So it's a little bit misleading. The tax credit represents 25 to 30 percent of our budgets, and they are uh, this new policy would eliminate 75 percent of that 25 leaving us not competitive with any other tax jurisdiction in the country.